What's going on y'all? This is Czar. I want to show you how to remove your unused files, or as I like to call it, removing the dead weight from your Studio One session. Uh, doing this will result in smaller session sizes. Um, if you're sending Studio One sessions back and forth with someone, the whole session, um, this can help shrink that size. Um, now if you're uh, exporting your files to give to someone in another DAW, uh, this would not affect that. But uh, removing unused files takes all the files in your session that you are not using and can remove them and delete them. So uh, what a lot of people may not know is that um, when you record into Studio One or really any DAW and you undo, that file is still on your hard drive. Uh, just to show that, I've got a track that I recorded here. Mic check one, two. Mic check one, two. And I'm going to right click on that and go to select in the pool. And you can see the file here. Now, if, if I undo that, it's gone, but the file is still here in the pool. Mic check one two, mic check one two. So even though you un you undo and remove the file, the file is still on your hard drive. So that is now considered an unused file uh, because it's not in the session. Now uh, the way to remove that, there's two ways. While you're in the audio pool, you can right click and go to uh, remove unused files. You can also go under song and select remove unused files. So this is a session from uh, Saxton that I uh, recorded in Studio One and there's a lot of uh, you know takes that we had to undo uh, during the course of the song. All those files are still on my hard drive. So going to remove unused files is going to give you a list so we can expand that, yeah. It's going to give you a list of all the unused files in the session. And you want to check this delete file permanently. Now, if you're one of those um, people who like to keep everything, keep every take, you don't have to do this. Uh, but you know, I'm done mixing this song. I know I'm not going to use any of these other uh, takes. And so I'm going to go ahead and delete them. And you can see it cleared up uh, my pool a lot. So uh, when I first started engineering, I was using uh, Logic 5. And it was maybe a year and a half after using it that I learned this feature. I went back and removed the unused files from every session that I had did in that year and a half. And it, it took me about a month. But I finally got through all of them. And it freed up, uh, I think it was about 60 gigs uh, of free hard drive space on my hard drive uh, just by removing all the unused files. Uh, so there's a good tip for y'all when you get through with a session, either recording or mixing, go ahead and remove uh, the unused files because it's going to save you hard drive space. It's also going to help your session load quicker because it's not loading all those files that you're not using anymore. All right, catch y'all next time.